Okay, let's try 13. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Hold up! Hold up! <laughs> Today I'm doing a first time ever beat review of my old beats. That's right. I'm talking ancient Tomb Raider beats, bro. They're so old, I had to put them on CDs. Do kids even know what burnt CDs are? We're gonna see just how, how terrible I was. Um, let's see what we got here. Uh, we're gonna pick number 10. Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. This is actually the first song that I ever recorded in a professional studio. Uh, I gotta let this song play. I gotta let this song play. Okay, hold up. Let me say this now. <laughs> let me say this quick. Get it out of my mouth. Watch this, watch this. Hit you like a brick. Jesus <laughs> died for you. Jesus. Whoa, <laughs> I was a beast, bro. I was, I think I was like 13 years old. It was 2003. The story is I started off as a gospel artist, right? Cause I'm a, a PK, I'm a preacher's kid. And so I started off making gospel music. All of my influences like Tone A and all that stuff were my main influences. I wrote this song. It's about the crucifixion of uh, Jesus. I, I produced a track. I found like some piano clip or something. I reversed it. And then I put like these little trap hi-hats on there when before trap even existed bro i was ahead of my time wait 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 listen 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 to the trap <laughs> Man, I had some trap drums going on. And this masterpiece came out and it was like the hit in all the local churches in San Diego. I got the little drums in there. I mean the guitar. <laughs> Super like trying to merge R&B with hip hop with rock. He died for crucifixions for the remissions of our wrongdoings. It's terribly painful. To know we died for us. When we turn around and did the wrong stuff. For clicking on the first song is the first song I ever recorded. That is insane. What's the next one? I'm gonna go to 12. Da, da, da. This could be like a Lil Yachty song. It's like Lil Yachty featuring uh, Uzi. Uzi. Now this song, this is a, a case I had to work with what I had And at that time, I didn't have any good piano sounds I didn't have any good, I didn't have any VSTs, period I had zero VSTs All I had was FL Studio or Fruity Loops Whatever was in that program and whatever I sampled myself is what I had which is why I have a very large uh, library of samples, loops, drum kits, all that stuff, because I used to sample it myself. Thousands upon thousands of sounds that I spent years putting together. If you guys want to cop that, by the way, you can join my Patreon and it's available there. <laughs> so bad, so bad. Okay, let's try 13. Whoa! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Whoa, hold up, hold up. <laughs> I was programming drums like this back then. Wait, 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 wait. I might have to, I might have to sample those drums right there. That is hard. Ooh. Oh. You had to kill the beat with this whack melody, bro. Ah, uh, the rest of the song sucks. I'm definitely gonna sample those drums and then put it into something else. Cause this, that, it, like Ethan, Ethan and <laughs> that is sick. Hold up. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and eject that. I'm, I'm done with this one. Let's see what's on Enzo newest beats. 
and let's hope it plays because the backs of these things are so scratched up. That's, uh, I'm surprised. <laughs> what have we got on here? <laughs> The number you have reached, 911, has been changed. You're not having to have What is going on? Just turn on the first track, and all you hear is a gunshot, explosions, and people crying and dying. <laughs> I am very theatrical with my, my songs. Maybe not so dramatic nowadays, but okay. <laughs> there was a literal, there was a literal bomb that just exploded on this track. <laughs> Where's the music? We gotta skip, we gotta skip that. Hey. Hey, everybody but the kid the dibble bubble dibble 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 me not knowing what I was doing while I was making a track because I forgot to cut off the bass. I don't remember that one. I do remember this intro though. When you see the red light go on, would you please state in the following order your destination, your nationality, and your full name? Whatever album this is, dystopian future, rapture, end of the world, I was like obsessed with the end of the world. <laughs> See, it's like it's like Skynet just hacked into my brain right now. Skynet has become self-aware. Ink. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. It's not mixed very well. Woo. Now that's that's kind of that's kind of hitting, bro. I gotta give it to my, my, my younger self, my 14 year old self. That was pretty hot for a 14 year old who don't know what he's doing in FL Studio. Oh my goodness. I remember this too. I gotta, I have to do this too. Yo, this is when my beats started stepping up, bro. This is Enzo 2.0 before Legend was about to be born. This is a legend in the making. Pretty, pretty good. It's average. I do remember this one. Oh my god, wait! I remember making this beat because I just found these so these these drum sounds and I was like, man, I want to make like a Pharrell, Snoop Dogg type West Coast hitter my drum my drums really stepped up on 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 this one i don't know what year this is from but this is hot um dude we're getting into the rock beats uh, and I, I gotta i gotta stop here because i'm a, i'm gonna save my rock beats for like a separate beat evaluation so this was just me checking out my old beats how far i've come from like having nothing having no vsts having a keyboard i was literally playing these instruments and stuff with a literal keyboard i was using these as the piano keys all i had was a mouse and a keyboard and i had to sample everything myself i hope this can be like a way to inspire all the producers and music makers who are on this channel subscribed and this goes for anybody creatively where you're at right now will not be where you're at 10 years from now you will improve 
your craft, your art, whatever it is you do on so many levels. Just you have to be consistent. You have to keep going. With that being said, I'm going to stop it here and I'm going to save that for the next one. Uh, if you like this video, if you enjoyed it, you know, leave a like down below. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe. Turn on the bell notification so you'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. As always, be legendary. Keep grinding and let's do this. Yeah. This, oh my god, wait.